All right, guys, welcome back to another video on SDS. Uh, we haven't done this one in a while. We are doing another hot takes episode. Um, one change, though. Usually we tweet out asking for you guys to send us hot takes. We only decided we're going to do this um, no. just now. So we have <laughs> custom-made hot takes for us. Hey, it's bonus, bonus, um, bonus, bonus. Yeah, well, it's bonus. We've Sorry, guys, man. We've got some custom-made. Lame made, We've got some custom-made uh, hot takes ones regardless. Yeah. Um, how you guys can get involved is you can put in some more hot takes in the comments for us to maybe discuss in future episodes. Or you can actually discuss the hot takes that we've discussed in the comments if you agree or disagree or whatever, right? Get involved. Really, really helps <coughs> when we read your comments and uh, helps for us to know what you guys think because mm -hmm. obviously we are one big family. Um, so yeah, the hot mm -hmm. takes that we are doing, um, the way this usually works is loosely, I read out a statement. If you agree, you put your hand up. If you disagree, you keep your hand down and then we discuss based on whatever, how many mm -hmm. you have the hands up and hands down. Obviously, if you guys listen to the audio version right now, don't worry, you know, because I'm such a great host. I will let you guys know whose hands up. Yeah. His hands what an amazing man. What a professional. That's, 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 that's not easy. That's exactly. not easy. Only one round of applause, but first. Yeah, that was Ilias. He did it. And it's, I saw his hands <laughs> all the time. Yeah, I didn't move once. <laughs> I didn't move, but I heard clapping. Um, so yeah, that's how it's going to work. But like I said, feel free to get involved, please. Uh, okay, so the first hot take, um, pretty simple one. We've got to start off easy. It says KDB is the best Premier League player at the moment. Agree. Agree. At the moment. Hands up, huh? I mean, at the moment, he only played like 20 minutes. As in, as in, is he the best player in the Premier League? Is the question. I'm sure. It's a, this is at the moment. <coughs> is he the best player in the Premier League? That's a bit vague, no? It says, it says KD, I, I'm reading out what I've been given. Yeah. It says KDB is the best Premier League player at the moment. Yeah, but he's, in the, he's playing in the Premier League. Are you yeah, starting, bro? Put your hand up with chest. Fouad's hand is up. My hand was up before. Abs though. asked for clarification. Uh, I, I need some clarity as well. If we were talking at the moment, no. If we're talking Premier League as a whole, KDB. Yeah, everything Salah's done the this season. season didn't give you either, so you decide. Mm. For you, Elias, hands up. And okay, I'll put my hand up as well because I'm a follower. <laughs> no, 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 he's the best player out now in the Premier League, and because he's active playing yeah. and he's fit, he's now qualifies for active current playing Premier League players. Absolutely, and he's the best person that's actively playing. If we're saying best player of the season, Mohamed Salah's done everything to prove that he's the best player of the season, but. Oh, yeah. the incoming tears. So it's his league, bro. This yeah, is his yeah, league, bro. Yeah, yeah. It's, is it it's the been his league for a while. Yeah. It's the Bruyne's league. It's the league. league. Is it Salah's it's league? It's the league. Or was it Kane's bro. league until he left? They were the big three for me. Yeah, they yeah, were. Yeah, sure. Were of course, they were the big three. three. But, but what, what ultimately it comes down to is league titles and trophies won. And, and, and an impact on and those impact, trophies yeah, won. And impact on those trophies. And Kevin De Bruyne, as we said. That's what comes down to more than the other two, because come on, like, so many players have won more Premier League players, more Premier than yeah, Salah. Think, not, yeah, 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 yeah. The thing with Salah is he's always a standard bearer for the goal scorers. Yeah. I always feel like the top goal scorer, yeah. if you're going to be- Playmaking as well though, boot, now. Of course, the past year or so, he's completely hit a new arc, if you like. But mm. I always feel like he's been that, if you're going to win the Golden Boot, he's the man you've got yeah. to beat, if that Absolutely. makes sense. But in terms of oh, for sure. just yeah, being yeah. the best player in the league, I think mm. we've always looked at Kevin De Bruyne as yep. the, the biggest difference maker. The guy who, at times, we've looked at as- best player in Europe, best player in the world. Do you know what I mean? And yep. Salah, we've looked at at moments as well, but Kevin De Bruyne for me is just more undeniable. Mm. And I think just on the weekend, gives you prime example, bro. <laughs> Guy comes back four minutes, inevitable. Last couple minutes, needs it. Crunch time turns up. So prime time is just well. a reminder. Mm. It's my National league. TV. It's his my league. league, Salah. Yeah. It's his league. Yeah. Hope you enjoyed Christmas. <laughs> it's my league now. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> He did back. <laughs> yeah, back. It's gonna be interesting to see when Salah comes back from the Afcon and how they, like, you know, if, if they both perform at the mm. high levels, we will need to see that. Battle. Be a good run. Last time Salah good. came back from Afcon, it was very quiet. Yeah, he was. I remember, he was. We'll see. We'll he see. He might come back early if Egypt. Mm. I and I remember start. that season as well. The first half of that season, people, he was on the type of form that people were saying best player in the world. Yeah. I remember. So it's funny. Could be eerily the same. Mm. Interesting. Okay. All right, uh, another oh, one. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Another one we got here. It says, "Man United should sell Marcus Rashford." For words, hands gone straight up. Are you a follower? Mm. Three of us have. Should two of us have? Man United should sell Marcus Rashford. For words, hand is firmly up. So for me, yeah. What are you doing, Sharks? I got to push you for an answer. Should yeah? you sell Marcus Rashford? Should we? <coughs> Who wants to be a millionaire? No, I'm my hands down. Ab's hands still down. Mm -hmm. Nah, hands down. So only for words, hand is up. So Speak let's discuss. For me, I think he just symbolizes maybe the past five or six years of United. If there's kind of one overarching kind of player of it, I look at it as Rashford, in my opinion. And yeah. I think if, yeah, very up and down, 
very unable to give you consistency. They've given him the left wing. They've given him through the middle for a few seasons. Mm -hmm. He's never been able to latch onto anything and really take the mantles of this team. As the kid coming from the academy, given the number 10 shirt, I feel like by now at this point in your career, this should be your team. Mm -hmm. I still can't look at it and still trust him to take this team, if that mm -hmm. makes sense. And ask a lot of United fans, they still don't trust him. So for mm -hmm. me, it's a case of at this age now, what more do you have to gain? It's a little bit like um, Arsenal with Theo Walker, I remember a few years ago, where they, they came to a point in the realisation, all right, this one isn't the new one, yeah. This one isn't going to be that supreme talent that we thought he's mm. going to be but he's going to be a good player for yeah. sure. like Rashford I think Rashford is just a good player but as long as he stays at United he's going to get given this kind of special treatment because he's one of their own I feel like the minute he walks away from it everybody starts treating him like what he actually is just a decent player mm. but he's almost put on this pedestal at United and I feel like for as long as he's there other players will be impacted whether it's them demanding supreme wages because this guy's on it and he's not really providing much a la Martial type. But mm. for me, it just, if you want to move to a new era, <coughs> that's the kind of player who I feel like you just need to get it's out of the door. Go. I, I understand that angle. I understand that the angle. Yeah. 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 Understand. It's crazy with Rashford because when he burst onto the scene, if you look at it back then, you would think he would have been on like an Mbappe kind of yeah. Oh, they were being compared mm -hmm. at one point. Yeah, they were being comp dead. Obviously, com like completely different ages. Mm -hmm. What's Mbappe? Twenty? Not completely. Not completely. What's Mbappe? Twenty-five. Mbappe's twenty-five, 25. Mbappe's 25 now. 25. Rashford's like twenty-six. Mm. He's twenty-five. They're not completely <laughs> different. <laughs> I always think Mbappe's still like twenty-two. You know, twenty-two. <laughs> <now>. For some <laughs> reason, I think yeah, he's yeah, twenty-two. Yeah, I, get you. I'm the I same. need him. I need a few <laughs> more years. <laughs> he's he's aged quickly. Yeah, he has aged quickly. But um, no, at that time when they both came up, I thought, yo, if Alex Ferguson was still at United, he would have he would have kicked Rashford like. And he would have made him the demanded player. Like, he would have demanded level, like yeah. he would have been the superstar. Yeah. I think he would have probably been the maybe arguably the face of the Premier League. Mm -hmm. Should be face of England. Should mm -hmm. be like face he of would, Man United. Yeah, face be. of Man. Like he would have been if Alex Ferguson was there. But Absolutely. he's had so many different managers. Obviously, that doesn't help for a player of his such a young age when he came up. Yeah. And Mourinho said there's a difference between a young player and a player who's played 300 games. Thanks. That's a man compared to a young player. Mm -hmm. So I feel like I understand the angle you're coming from. Yeah. Like his wages and everything. it trickles down to all the players because yeah. they're like oh he's playing kind of mid he's had one very good season i can demand for 100 grand less than him mm -hmm. and i've put up better numbers than yep. him and things like that but then at the same time he is like right now he is mr man united mm -hmm. shouldn't be but he is mr manchester and, that, and that's what i feel like is as long as he <coughs> is mr man united yeah united are going to be in this kind of weird phase of not really competing for trophies mm. and just being in this weird mishmash area. So, so you're saying if Man United would were not were to improve in the next couple of years, you wouldn't see Rashford in the team of possible improvement for Man yeah. United uh, if at all. If Rashford, better players were around, if not better if players were around, yeah, fully. I, I think th there's. I think you can actually flip Rashford and get better players. You can sell Rashford and get a player that gives you the same type of output he gives you. In my mm. opinion, Unless, he's not yeah. that unique or a one of one talent that's like, oh, we have yeah. to look after him till he retires. Yeah. Nah, bro, this is business. This we're here to win and I'm sorry the patience can only go on for so long and before I admit this is, speaks a lot yeah, of logic so there so is, yeah for yeah. me he speaks like I say he speaks a lot he makes a lot of good points I feel like I'm kind of compromised when it comes to, to Rashford especially uh, and I'd say Bruno as well both players who have been such important players for United over the last couple of years but, exactly, I but would say yeah, well. yeah I was gonna say that's exactly if you're gonna improve exactly. you actually need to move yeah. on Bruno <laughs> and get a Saudi bid <laughs> see you later Rashford, Rashford PSG yeah. go and sell him some yeah. project there and, or and, something. The, and the reason why I'm compromised those two is that yes this has been some United's worst periods but they have been by far and away the clear best players the game winners you were talking about individual brilliance that United have earlier it comes mainly from them two in this team mm -hmm. I feel like it's so tough when it's United because what you're saying makes sense with a project. Any smart project would yeah. be what was the the, the, the the legacy before? We're ripping that out yeah. and we're starting again. Yeah. At United, if you were to get rid of Rashford and Bruno out of that team, Ooh. can Man United go and go through that suffering period? This is why I feel like Here's a project or a process it's can't that, even work at United. It's fear of the unknown, right? Mm. I would have thought the same before Kane left. Mm. I would have thought I hear you. And I'm sure Arsenal would have thought the same after Henri left. Mm. Am I right in saying after Man that Percy season, the 08 well, 09, you lot went on to challenge for the title? <coughs> yeah, yeah. But, but with so respect, it doesn't, with when, respect. When Hazard left, yeah. Chelsea went on to go win the Champions League. Like some point, with respect the to all three of those clubs, be the worst thing agreed, agreed. actually ends up being a better thing uh, for the totality uh, of uh, the uh, club. And, that and, and, and that's why I say it's. it's, it's it's with respect what to those three clubs, it's a different level when it comes to Man United. And United can't go. So far down, like we can, we're down bad. We've been down bad yeah. for ten years. But there's no. Like, if we it. were to breach 
how bad we've been and become worse, it just wouldn't happen. Decisions nah, would be made. Managers would be fired. All this kind of stuff. The player power thing in general is obviously where the players are going to outlast managers yeah. anyway. And the club will much rather sack one person than even think about getting rid of huge players in mm-hmm. for, for the team that have been huge for so many years. You're right in terms of what you want to build for the future. I just feel as though if you were to take out these two players from the team now, how bad we'd be would be unforgivable at Man United. You and don't know that. You're predicting that. No, but it's you United, don't know that for but it's sure. Already, it's already you untenable right sure now. Because the way Garnacho's come out all of a sudden, it's like, hey, you know what? Mm. The way Kobe Mainu's come out all of a sudden, it's like, oh, you know what? So it's like, you never know what's going to come next. And I think that fear of the unknown for me is where I'm like, what unknown? Because really and truly, they've papered over cracks in a period where you've been down bad. And because they've given you those individual moments, you're almost like, oh, mm. you've been my saving grace in those yeah. dying mm. moments. Mm. And then I treasure that's, that's you for truth. that. And that's I respect truth. that. Yeah, that's true. But that hasn't brought you any trophies. No, it hasn't. And that's the Man United standard. Of course. Don't let that slip in terms of, ah, oh, you've just given yeah, but you're me saying, a But you're moments. saying take a step back to go I've got forward, a question right? as well. I, I, not even take a step back. <coughs> if we were even, to get rid of Rashford, we'd take be a back. worse I don't even think it's that much. A, no, no, you, we'd be a worse football I'm sorry, team. That's you, for sure. You lost, in terms of creativity, you attacking. Lost, yeah. okay, I, right, I think you can lose Bruno and bring in a midfielder who gives you that same what he gives you. I don't know, but I'm sure. On the same level. If you gave me time and I looked up, I'm sure I could get you a great. There's no one better than If you lot got rid of Rashford and you lot played worse, would you feel much different to how you feel now watching Manchester United? I would think, there be a big difference in like your feeling towards the club? No, you would like, still feel that disconnect of like, of yeah, course. we don't have anything at the moment. No, 100%. But because it's Rashford, because he's Mike born and bred, because he has all that's of that it. on his side, yeah, that is a lot of stuff that is, that is, that is on his side. Like, which is why- Take off them rose tinted glasses. It's, it's easier said issue. than done. It's and easier said than done. Back. Back. You, got, you got rid of Danny Welbeck once upon a time. And that's what's holding you back, bro. It's not It's not quite the same level. Rashford's done a lot more for Man United than Danny Welbeck did. Welbeck was Man United. Hey, yeah. He was all-time, all-time Premier League goal. And he came to Arsenal. Huh? Scored and Who's got more? Hey. Celebrated. I know Russia didn't even hit 100 club yet. That's insane. He's hit 100 he should club. Be 100 no, he hasn't. No, nah. he has, he has. Not, I remember him doing 100 he, celebrations. He's not 100 Prem, though. 100 Prem? Not 100 Prem. No. He's got yeah, 18 in the Prem. I was about to yeah, say, bro. Yeah. You said 100 club. Yeah, 100, uh, 100 club is Premier League. Club, Premier League, Premier League. Yeah. 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 Goals, 100 at the club. How long have you been in? How many How many Wubs got in Premier League? Let me check, actually. Obviously, a lot older. But like I was saying... Check it, yeah. Like I was saying, if you lot were to get rid of Rashford, I feel like you're not gonna get much worse. And the feeling uh, with the fans you know, and right the club, now on form, I agree. With that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Because right so now he's playing. Let's say, let's say now level. the summer comes, yeah, and you blow the whole thing up. You get rid of Rashford. You get rid but of Bruno. Can't send, they just can't send to another Prem club because no, they can't they'll burn them. Yeah, yeah. No, you get rid of Rashford. You get rid of Bruno. 64. You get rid of um, uh, Martial. You get rid of all the Maguires. You get rid of all these players, and then now you go and look also, for. Also obviously, in, it takes a long time. Yeah, it's and a very Ineos long process. Are trying to go for an English kind of core. They're not yeah. getting rid of Rashford. Maybe of course it's more not. likely yeah, they yeah. get yeah. Bruno. Get rid of Bruno. But you got a guy called Sir yeah. who's running the club right now. Yeah, he's not. You, 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 you're, not you're not going any other. Do the guy you're talking about as well, Sir as well. Mm. Nobody talking about. Earlier. Yeah, you see, he's Sir, just hella Sir. They're Holy going to English. Sir, why is everyone knighted already? Come on, they're knighted, man. You can't get. They come with VVS. Yeah, they they came with VVS. They came with VVS, bro. They came with VVS. For real, man. We got no Sirs at the club. For real, bro. Yes. He raised um, fair points. Raised very fair points. Well, Sir Shaka Mahmoud. Yeah, Sir Mark Mahmoud. Mahmoud. <laughs> Mark Mahmoud. <laughs> no. would, you, would you ever get knighted? If they well, offered Sir, you? Sir Mohammed Farah. But if they offered you a knighthood, would you do it? Get on them oh, knees, oh, man. No, nah, but that's, you can't <laughs> get on your knees. You can't get. You know what it says? I know. I know. I like that. I'll, I'll take down that knee, boy. As a Muslim, you can't do the knighthood and get on your knees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to just do the little thing. Yeah, yeah. I'll take an OBE, MBE, something like that. Yeah. Okay, fair. I respect that. You didn't do what? Take it back. Take it back. Take it back. That guy's hilarious. He's so funny. Okay, let's. Igly. Legend. He's incredible. Okay. Okay, let's go on to uh, another one. We have okay, this one's interesting. Spurs is back four when fit is better than Arsenal's back four. Ooh. Abs hands up. We had both hands up without a shadow of a doubt. Uh, your best back four is better than our best back four. I agree. Okay, Abs yeah. I'm, I'm, do, I'm doing the comparison right now. Thinking, mine's down. So, so we go. Uh, You're one for four. Huh? Who's better? Who's, who's one for four? You're crazy. One for four, Saliba. You're crazy. Uh, you lot are definitely hands on you. Yeah, my hands down. Hands I'm, 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 I'm now doing, doing the comparison. I'm doing the comparison. No, before you consider. So, no, 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 I said mine's down. Oh, yours down completely. I'm waiting to see yeah, what yeah. he is. The way it is, is Left back, you annihilate us. Wash. Yeah, but he shouldn't even be Right back, back. wash. Okay, if we're going off this season, completely right. Wash. Completely facts. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. Yeah. Poro's yeah. a better right back. Yeah. You lot win. I'll give you. I'll give you. Yeah. Hands up. Wait, wait, wait. Wow. Wow. Okay. I said one for four, right? Goalkeeper, you So I'll give you Saliba over Van der Ven. 
Romero, Gabriel. I'm sorry, I'm taking Romero. 100%. Wait, wait, wait. Who He's plays smart with how he did it. Who plays left center? I like it. I like it. Who plays left center? Romero plays left center. 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 We got it, boys. Don't kill the ladder. We got it, boys. Calm down right now. We got it, boys. Calm down right now. Calm down right now. Walking back. Center back for center back. We're going. We're going position for position. What are we doing? We're going machine for machine. No. We're going in. Back We're going Who's your best centre back? It's not Who is your best centre back for? Okay, We're back let's, four. let's yes. compare. Let's so compare. we got two centre okay. backs. Let's yeah. compare. Oh, picking. semantics. Uh, yeah. So who? I like is, it. So who are your two best centre backs? The man in my centre back position. I'm not the man in my centre back Listen, we're not drawing up a combined eleven here. No, we're, we're not comparing. Mm. We're comparing, oh, lads. I love it. It's oh, one for one. So who's your best centre back? Saliba, right? My one is Romero. Is Romero. We okay. can compare. No problem. Okay. Can, Saliba. Yeah. No, 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 no. You're saying. You're yeah, saying. Yeah, 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 no, 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 no,
Mm. Declan Rice is a huge part of that. Exactly. He's a huge part of that. You want to add him in as well? The sumo? No. Add him in? Oh. Uh, chill, chill. Because defensively. <laughs> you, you, defensively. You're digging yourself yeah, a hole, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, which you almost pre-lune. had him. You nibbled. Well, like, Prelude. Prelude. Yeah. Yeah. Who would have had them? Who would have had them? Nah, he would never have, he's never, <laughs> he's never been better than Declan Rice, so he never will be. About flipping jello fries. What do you call it? What do you call it? What do the expressions call it? Yeah. What do the expressions call it? What do the expressions call it? I don't even know what expressions call it. Bro, I don't know. Expressions got 99 different names for Bro, he's brilliant. brilliant. He's one he's of brilliant. one of That's All a right, word. Let's go to another one. We'll go to Liverpool. Um, I know Fuiz would keep his hand down for this, but this Fuzzy, where is he? This statement will be. Uh, said Fuzzy's going to put his hand he'll down. He'll keep his hand down for this if he was here. Oh, if he was here, okay. Uh, the statement says Liverpool will not win another Premier League as long as Pep is in the league. Liverpool will not win another Premier League? Yeah, you're yeah. damn right. Yeah. No one's winning another Premier League as long as Pep's here. He has hands up. Oh. My hand is down. Yeah. Pep Mohamed Guardiola. <laughs> Come on, man. Can't be that guy. Can't be him, man. You can't be him. Can't can't be his hand up as well. Can't can't be him. No, you think a team can if be If anyone can win the league over Pep, is Klopp. I agree. We're well, yeah, see this we're we're gonna gonna see this yeah, that's proven. He can't do it again. We're going to see this year. He won't do it again. I think the four P will happen, but I think there's going to be a gap here. Yeah. Well, if Pep leaves after the four P, I, I think he I might. Think, he mm. might, but I think Klopp will. No, no, I don't think Pep will leave. I think Pep is going to stay at City for a while. Because what's he going to do next? He's yeah, he's the complete international football. football. You know he's, he's complete, complete football. football. No, he's going to he's gonna, he's gonna do in his seventies yeah. and all that, bro. <laughs> yeah. like, like now, I think he's in a situation where he's appreciated. He likes the perfect club. He's built it. Let's perfect be honest. Situation. So I, I don't, he's I got the keys to everything. Yeah, I think he's staying here, and he's he's his plan is to dominate the Premier League in such a way, almost mm. like Fergie. Yeah, when I've left, there's a man that's going to come. I think he wants to do that. Twenty years, we need to catch this guy. So I, I think he's going to be here for a while, but I think mm. if someone's going to take advantage, it'll be Klopp. How many Pep's terrified of Klopp. Yeah. You see the documentary when he won he's, 100. And he's, yeah. Klopp Klopp is a good manager. Klopp Klopp some people said on this table him. that Arteta's better than Klopp. Silly on this, guys. Who said it on this table? Huh? What? Silly guys. Huh? Yeah, yeah, silly guys. Yeah. Silly guys. Silly guys. I agree, but I'll let Leo say what, me. I'm allowed to be biased. I'm going to ask him. You know what it was. It's true, is it? You know it's worse on Leo's, you know that? Because he's an Arsenal fan. He's a liar. Leo's was like, yeah, but Klopp's better than Arteta, right? Huh? Klopp's better than Arteta, right? There's managers and there's coaches and there's different styles, you know, there's like the the Ferguson. Is Klopp better than Arteta? Was Ferguson ever on the training pitch? He was never. Yeah, Ferguson was never. Ferguson wasn't even a coach. He was there. He was not a coach. Was he ever on the training pitch? No, he was there. He was in his office watching. No, he never used to take training sessions. Other times, I've seen, really? I've seen him there with the yeah. hat on. You've seen him yeah. over his ears when it was yeah. cold. Yeah, exactly. He's outside, bro. At times, yeah, but yeah, I'm saying, you like, think he's doing, yeah, let's do this. There's different trip. types. Yeah, he gives there good are things that elements that Arteta is better than a Klopp, for okay. sure. Okay, is Klopp better than Arteta? Like At what? Overall. At what? As a manager. Is At he what? Better? Is, is better looking, no. Tactically. <laughs> he's better looking, no. You know, is he a better footballer, no. Yeah, if you put a both in the pitch right now in terms of ping the ball, who's pinging the better? Oh, Arteta. Oh, yeah, but he's not the Arteta's level. Centre mid or centre back? back? I thought he was a, I thought he was centre off. I thought he was a centre mid. I mean, oh, he's signing. Yeah. I thought he was a centre off. Yeah, wherever he was. Pascal Gross. Wherever he was. Yeah. He, uh, he was good, Pascal before he Pascal. He was good as Arteta, so you know. Bro, it's not Arteta's better. Right? for Rangers than ever, man. Let's talk about it. But I use a PSG. I use a PSG with Ronaldinho. So what? You're, so your name? You really, so you really want to go back to nah, that PSG? Yeah, they were not so great. You're, 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 yeah. So what you just said is Arteta. I was there. He, he was there. He was there. He was there. He was there. He was watching him before the Euro so was going to Paris. You're there, like. You say Arteta was a Premier League servant. That's like the highest league. What, where, where did the Klopp play? Bundesliga. He played in Bundesliga. Yeah, he did. He did. He did. He did. What team? Mainz. Yeah, Mainz. Yeah, he played for Mainz. Center off. Center off. Premier League servant in his country. Yeah, Premier League servant, no. No, Bundesliga servant. Premier League were lit them days. Listen, obviously, yeah, Klopp. Of course, Klopp's better than Arteta. Come on, man. Come on, man. There you go. But then when when Leeds saying I agree. But Arteta has like a like tactical with everything. Is smelly. He's smelly. Smelly. Yeah, Elias said it's smelly. Smelly. When all is said and done, Arteta will win more Premier Leagues than Klopp. That's a fact. I don't believe that. Klopp's got one Premier League. Arteta will win more. There's a clip, guys. There's your clip. When so all is said and done, Arteta will win more Premier Leagues than Klopp. Yep. There you go. Guys, it's not a bad shot, you know. That is it's, not. it's only one. That, that's a whole take in itself. Like, when you say it's one, one. All right, hands, hands up. up if you agree. Uh, uh, Arteta hands up if you agree. Arteta will win more Premier Leagues than Klopp. You were Arteta out like three years ago. I think you? Klopp will win one and? more. And guess what? Arteta so that means Arteta, Arteta will win three. Arteta will win three. Arteta Arteta had three yeah. birthdays since then. Life changes, bro. What the hell? <laughs> the only way I'm thinking he's thinking this will happen is Arteta will eventually leave Arsenal, take over Pep after. <laughs> there we and go. Then win the league. Wins now you understand me. I've oh, seen this for his chest. It's a science. It's a science. I didn't say what Arsenal. I clocked it. I clocked it. Fair enough. 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 Fair enough.
Fine. This will be six if he wins this year. Yeah. I can't lie, he's not far. It's far no, but it's far. He's got to double it again. Double it again, double it again. But he can do he's this. He's not going to win years. six in a row, though. He could do 20 this for Another 20 years. years. Football's going to be different. Much, huh? Imagine football in 20 years. No, but, but do you know the thing? Do you know what yeah, I know? Yeah, Pep, Pep yeah. would be the one who's innovating it again. Of over then as well. Of course. Do you think <laughs> there'll be three halves? Be, well, did you see the FIFA World 11 thing? The 3 3 4 formation. Oh, yeah. Good one, man. Pep's going to be doing that. Good one, man. Yeah, you see. Good one, man. All right, let's 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 uh, read out another one. I got, I got a hot take. Can I say? It? Oh yeah, cool. you know what? Can I say? It? Tables are Floor's yours, bro. Does Eden Hazard make? No, no, you got to say it as a statement. Yeah, yours, your belief. It doesn't <laughs> be your belief, but just say. It. What's the statement that you want us to either agree or disagree on? Eden Hazard does not make the Premier League all-time eleven. My hands up. Fouad's hands up. He's in my all-time eleven. Uh, Abs' hand is down, and Ilyas. He's in, he's he, ma- he makes it my one. Makes it my so, one. On the left wing. So when I have the front three of Thierry Henry, Mo Salah, so, uh, and Cristiano nah, Ronaldo. Nah, nah, yeah, nah, who does he replace? Nah, nah, okay, so nah, nah. Where, on the right. Who That's my front he, three. Who does he drop? So are we going position for position or just straight attackers? I'm, I, Ronaldo's I, best years Ronaldo's at United left was wing. Yeah, I put Ronaldo on the left. His best Ronaldo season left was left wing. wing. But, but he played on the right and the left. Okay. Almost both. equal amount of time. People so try to but his best right So where's Eden going? Where is Eden's on the left for me. And I put Ronaldo on the right. Yeah, what's your mind? And then what? Salah, uh, Salah's not there at all. No, the only reason for me, for me, I'm a Salah over I'm Eden guy. Ma- I'm a Salah over Eden guy. So how are you gonna have I'm both for them? And but, Ronaldo and Henri. I put on, I put Ronaldo on the right and Eden on the left. I don't put it's Ronaldo. So on you the said left you're a Salah right. over Eden. So where's Salah? He, do, he doesn't make it. Well, Salah's you not said you're Salah Ronaldo. over Eden. Salah's not better than Ronaldo. I'm tweaking. <laughs> Yo, you're tweaking. No, no, I'm tweaking, tweaking. You are tweaking. Do you know what it is? It's um, 2 a.m. right now. So I don't yeah. understand. Yeah. What, what are you it's tweaking not, on? Were you no, tweaking on the Eden of a Salah tweet. or the- I tweet. The... My hand goes so up. So you're Eden <laughs> goes up. Uh, goes up. I'm Eden of a Salah. Eden gets into my team. And because Ronaldo played almost about equal amount of years on the right and the left, I put him on the right. He can play both sides. What's your mind? Uh, He's the best. Uh, Who's the best for attackers? Them three. I'm happy with that. Listen, that's not uh, 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 brother, this isn't this crazy. And also, I'm not on mad. top of that. On yeah, top of also, that, I'm, I not mad. Take... I'm not mad at guys who say Salah's in the yeah, all-time yeah, As he shouldn't be. Crazy. Yeah, on top of that, he could even take... I could even, you... take, I could even put Henri on the left wing and put flipping someone like Rooney up front. But I don't not mind that. But Hazard's not getting in there. Zero. I said, but Hazard's not getting in like I'm a bit too soon, mate. I can name like a couple different variations and Hazard's not in there for me. Great player. Hazard's not in there for me as well. Okay, you could have... So how's Hazard... What about Ryan Giggs on the left? No. So, oh, no right. way. All time no, assist maker. Br- no, brilliant player. Brilliant player. Premier League legend. That's what I'm saying. Just wouldn't, wouldn't be in my team. So yours is Hazard, Hazard Ronaldo, 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 and Titi. So fr- best good front three. Good my front three. three's better than you guys is. Nah. nah. 100% yeah. is. No chance. As players. Yeah, yeah as players, of course. No we're talking about like just the Premier League all time no eleven. My, my front three. And then in midfield, obviously, Salah. everyone knows it's Gerard. The Bruyne. Gerard, Gerard's in the Premier League all-time level. 100%. With no Premier League titles. With no Premier League titles. What's your, your VVS? You can't hate from outside the club. You can't even get in. Uh, put Calvin Phillips in there then. He's got a Premier League title. No, but he's not good enough. Oh, so now it's not, not good Premier League titles. No, no. But Premier Gerard League. is good enough. No, but it's a threshold. He went there. No, no he Calvin Phillips is allowed. Cal- Calvin Phillips is allowed to put his name in. I'm not listening, no. I'm not listening. No. I'm, not, I'm not listening. You got a Premier League title, but sorry, no, you're not good enough to be in my team. So wait, to get into the all-time level, you have to have won the Premier League. You there's not an, ex- a, a, an exception for one player like Gerard. If there's anyone like an exception, it would be him. But still, for me, he's not in mine. He's not in mine. Who's your midfield? Yeah. I'm midfield. Just off top. Skulls, obviously. Skulls, easily. Skulls. Vieira. Vieira, De Bruyne. Mm. So Skulls, Vieira, De, De Bruyne. That is a balanced midfield. Like that, That's a brilliant midfield. Oh. That midfield's all right. Yeah, it's nasty. Yeah, yeah, that's Vieira, Gerard, KDB. Yeah, no, man, yeah, it's a good midfield. It's a good as midfield. As well. You know what I mean? It's a that good midfield. Nasty. I like a midfield. But Vieira's been a, a, a DM6 now, yeah? No, how about... Because you've got fans yeah. love to deny they that They love to deny that. I'm saying, yeah. to make space, we're putting Ronaldo on the left when he played most of it. No, 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 I'm doing that. That's my... Yeah. Arsenal. <laughs> no, but I can do that on my team. He rejected that I'm idea. I'm saying, to fit him in his team, I'll put him... So I'm... I'm he can play there. I'm fitting in someone like Hazard in my team. He had Petit there, Gilberto Silva there. No problem. But in this midfield, I'm doing it for my team as well. Same principle you just said now, where I'm fitting in someone in my team, I did that fitting in Hazard. I just said I could also make another age where I fit Henri on the left and Rooney in the middle. That's fine. But my midfield better yours. <laughs> nah, it's not. Wait, it's not. Who's your midfield? No, Lampard. That's sad, man. I I prefer your midfield. Lampard was in there before De Bruyne. Was De Bruyne. <clears throat> Yours was. Vieira. What's your midfield? Yeah, I don't even know your midfield. De Bruyne. That Roy What's your midfield? Roy Keane. <laughs> yeah, <Roy King. laughs> nah, I think I'd probably go with yours actually. Like the difference in mine his is uh, I've got Jared, he's got skulls. Yeah, and uh, so the balance is beautiful. Yeah. 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 The yeah. legs of yeah, the legs of yeah, yeah man. You got skulls. Yeah, 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 yeah,
I can't have a guy in my midfield who be chewing toenails, so I gotta put Steve Jarrett. So, so yeah, big him up, man. You don't have a foot fetish? It's nothing to do with football. No, I don't. Fetish. I'm just asking. I was gonna. <laughs> you me the point me to a man with a foot fetish. I'll point you to a sick individual. <laughs> yes, yes. A very sick individual. I don't. Yeah. Whoa. Where people? Oh, this is where people me. walk. Spider Man. Hey, 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 hey. Two biskets. That's why. Ah, yeah. Spider Man. Two lovers. Two lovers. Yeah. I think he's got a foot fetish. Never, never, never. Never. That's what you got into, yeah. Never, never. Sick individual. Not me, though. Cheese in between it. If there was anyone, if there was anyone around this table who had a foot fetish, who'd you guess it would be? It's got to be Illy, isn't it? <laughs> it's got to be Illy, isn't it? Sure, it's sure. got to be Illy. Isn't it? I feel like he's, he's like, you know, just, just put it in my face. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, nothing's even going on. Just stand on me. I'm watching the game. Just stand on me. Just put it in my face. Nah, nah. <laughs> no, no, no. Like, like that Asian brother on Twitter who gets foot slapped <laughs> on his face. I never, never, that. never. I'll never be me. Never be me. I just like pretty toes is nice. Pretty toes are good to look at. Yes. Oh, wait, wait. He's actually out. He's having a look at it. Pretty toes are good to look at. No, pretty Nothing toes else. are nice. Nothing else. Well, I, nothing else. I don't yeah, want to be playing with them. Not, yeah, yeah. No, no, nothing, else. nothing else. Nothing else. Nothing else. Nothing else. Uh, of course, man. Nothing nothing else. Else. Uh, okay, uh, another one. Yeah, SDS. This one's uh, this one's for uh, Abs. Yeah. James what? Trafford in the next ten years will be top three goalkeepers. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> James Trafford. We say top three all time. No, like he'll he'll be one of the top keepers in the league. Are you yeah, are you in I'm your sure. like Faisal bag right now with Trent, him and Trent, and you and Trafford? No, because it's not. It's not. It's not. He, he does that because it's for Liverpool fans. Just it off his back, bro. Yeah. James Travers is a good keeper. I like him. He's a nice young keeper, modern day goalkeeper. I think he'll do well in his career because because he's, he's been he's been sold by City. But I could see him go to a big club. Not now. Not as he is right now. He's still got a lot to learn. That last mistake is a big chance for him. Mm. Learn that grit and determination of having authority over your box. But yeah, I like James Trafford. Trafford, Old bro. Trafford. Mm. Old Trafford. Hey. Couple of years, let's have conversations, yeah. bro. You don't have a high top. <laughs> <laughs> Just leave my keep current keeper alone. You didn't need to do that. You didn't need to do that have a current keeper. <laughs> so what's wrong with Banana, man? What is it's are we doing this right now? Are we yeah. doing this right now? Black goalkeeper. <laughs> to be fair, yeah, he's just listen, our team has to get it doesn't make sense signing Onana. Anthony, before yeah. you get too set up. You're, you're making me but do you're this happy again. about the Orlando signing. No, because it makes sense, but it's early. It's too soon in the process. Oh, if you're building a project, that's like a, I want to change Man United into a footballing team. Well, you God do start, you do start from a right goalkeeper, though. There's not a lot of evidence. You do start from the yeah. keeper. But I'm saying, you do when it's a ball-playing goalkeeper, you yeah. need two, two ball-playing centre-halves, a backline and a, and a DM that can actually play the ball in the first Yeah, not Casemiro. Oh. And, not Casemiro, and, do you know what I'm Good morning. Good, 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 good morning. Good 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 morning. Well, you got Alte now. I'll tie by in there. Playing against Newport. I've seen a fail comp playing against Newport him. or Eastley. Oh, play, yeah. play against? You got either, your next game is the winner of Newport or Eastley. Oh, is it? Yeah. yeah. You reckon he'll play that? He'll play on Anna? <laughs> yeah, somehow. <laughs> he'll, Anna fly fly back. Back. he'll fly him back. He'll play on Anna yeah. somehow, bro. He's got, some, he's got a fetish for his former players, you know. He hasn't played at all. But he's mad your link to Delict today as well. But I see that. our favourite at Bayern. Imagine Delict and Leach are wide areas. Oh, that is. Who's covering for who? Yeah, yeah. Who's covering for who? He's got a cover here. He's got a cover. Oh, it's just going to be long. It can't be delayed. Anyone else have a hot take someone else. I want to bring up? Um, if we're worldwide, give something that's not prime, maybe. Oh, yeah, we've all very hello. Um, okay, I got one. Pe Real Madrid are the last real football club. What do you mean? Remaining. What do you mean? Like, they still. They're like authentic football. Yeah, man. I don't think that. Arsenal in that bracket? Huh? Wouldn't you put Arsenal in that bracket? What is it? With Real Madrid, I don't know. It's like, I'm my hands <clears> up. <throat> when I look at them, I don't know. They're just. Maybe it's the whole like then they like the Galacticos again. There's something about Real Madrid. I just look at and I'm like, that is, if you're gonna if you want a club to represent football, it's Real Madrid. It's a football yeah. institution. Like it's like okay, Real Madrid is the best football football institution. I think. What would you say they're the biggest club in the world? Ever? Yes. yes. No, like just that. worldwide, Ever, yes. everything included. Yes. They're the yes. biggest club in the world. I think. Ever. They, they are the best run club in the world. I think them and City mm. are the two best. I think run City clubs are better run. Bayern. Bayern. I think Bayern's different. You, in context, have City over Bayern. Oh, it's weird because Bayern, Bayern. So they're the only team. But it's so how they, they got there. No, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? If you look at them, maybe what, 2008? Yeah. They weren't in good shape, bro. Yeah. yeah. So to have done that, they put a mm. plan in place, bro. And I good think structure. the way they've done the last maybe 10, 12, 13 years, mm -hmm. model club for me. The signings that they've done, the way yeah. they're always able to recruit well dominate their domestic league by poaching talents. Like yeah. they're doing what PSG should have been doing in terms of recruitment wise. Yeah, very like weird that, that like, PSG yeah. don't move like them. It's for me, I think Madrid in terms of super club wise, mm -hmm. I think they are the example. But I think if you're talking like model big clubs, I think Bayern Munich definitely has to be up there in like terms of well run. Yeah. Also, yeah, well run, yeah. also like, uh, I don't know if this, 
I'm I'm a bit more inclined toward Barca than Madrid. I don't know if that's why I think this, but just gen- that their club, the identity of their club is just bring in the big win. names, talents, is win. Yeah. And, and, and you have Superstars. to respect that. Yeah. Yeah. By all, and, and do it in a way where it's huge names that are coming in, eyes everywhere. And, and that's what makes them such a huge club. But I feel like there's not necessarily like a, a, a way of Real Madrid football. Ain't nobody like care for that, bro. Yeah, nobody nobody do you know what I'm saying? But like Ten for me, Champions nobody care yeah, about that. Bro. But if you're, if you're winning, it doesn't matter. Uh-huh. If you're winning, it doesn't yeah, matter. Exactly I can pick, I can what I was going to say. Like, that's always the that, bottom line in football. I can cover that. that story of the playing way. Mm. Barca started that. Yeah. Because yeah. they were losing. Yeah. You got, to, you got to find something cute to tell the people the fans, when you're losing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Hey, we got a culture. Yeah. We, got, we got identity. Yeah. Yeah. We play a certain way. Because yeah. yeah. you're holding L's, brother. Mm. Of, course yeah. you got, of course you got to sell them mm. that dream. And then when you're who, winning who, with who, that, who was the best team he looks of all, crazy. Who was the best team of all time? But how long can you maintain that for? But if you just have the MO of just win, you're going to do By it. By any, any means necessary. You do that in any era. Yeah, yeah. You, you do, do it in any, any era. era. So mm, I think that's true. why Madrid have been I respect more smart the way they handle it. I do them. respect yeah. Madrid for sure. So for me, it's, it's not about identities. If your identity is winning, that's what they've been, bro. And that's yeah. why even you see the past decade of how they've dominated the Champions League, mm. where how we talk about that, that heritage and everything. Yeah. Bro, they haven't had that for about... 20 years or whatever before yeah. that bro. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, it's yeah. the fact that they they drilled it in us that I think even are, I think Jose yeah, Mourinho club, instilled yeah. most of it because I remember there's that he does that interview yeah. where he's like before I came how many of these players passed like the round of 32 the quarter yeah. finals, quarter yeah. finals yeah. and he named all them Ronaldo mm. this player that <laughs> player I think he said Ronaldo's the only one but mm. Di Maria mm. uh, all these players he had in his squad he had to and he was like them who they were. Yeah, yeah and he was like look at you we play for Real Madrid we should be going past yeah. and then he got them past those stages Great even appointment. though he they didn't win the Champions League with them no, he true. didn't win the Champions League with them. he instilled that winning mentality in DNA them was for when Ancelotti came we're gonna win yeah. whoever Zidane came we're gonna win do you know what I mean so like absolutely I've got a bit of a hot take this one did a I, I stated my opinion on Twitter and it kind of went a bit a bit mad. There was a lot of buzz about it, but it was about Jude and Pe- for me, Pedri is the best youngster on the planet. How old is Pedri now? He's older than Jude. I think he's. I don't agree with that. Twenty-two, I think I'd say. Nah. Check that. And what's Jude? Twenty. Mm, twenty. Yeah. Maybe twenty years old. Check up. How's he twenty years old? How old's Vinny? Vinny's like a bit older. I think twenty-two Vin- ish as well. Uh, uh, Pedri just turned twenty-one actually. Okay, yeah, November. Yeah. Pedri's twenty one. Vinny's basically Jude and Pedri the same age. But I'm uh, looking. I'm looking more at the. Musiala ahead of him. And Musiala. Yeah, I'll be real with you. I think Jude has Pedri been, for me. I'm worried that he has been ground to the, almost grinded too yeah. early, too soon, and I worry about his longevity, bro. I'll be real with you. I, I think like he's Pedri, a quality yeah. player, mm. but is he going to get the best out of himself at Barca? I don't know. I think it's Jude Bellingham is almost on this upward trajectory. I don't think mm. Madrid are going to slow down anytime yeah. soon. I think it's only gonna the gap is only gonna get bigger and bigger. Yeah, no, I Pedro, like, I think unless, I'm not, yeah, go on. And unless Pedri does something incredible with Spain or something like that, that stands him out. I think mm. as long as if Jude and Madrid keep dominating in that league and keep winning, yeah, there's not gonna be. A uh, I'm a big Pedri fan. I'm not saying he's obviously. Oh, I love Pedri. He's man. not better. But I think he's a better I, I, footballer. I'm more of a Gabby fan than Pedri. I'm not saying Gabby's better than Pedri. I think I Pedri's love, better. Than I, I like Gabby. I'm more I, of a Gabby I, I, I like Gabby as well. Small guy just throwing himself around. Two years younger than Pedri, Gabby is, and I think he's more of like a. That all round midfielder oh, type. Yeah. yeah, and the dog Bro, as well. He's I'm a complimentary like, midfielder for him. No, yeah, fact. yeah. Like, oh, I'm, I'm more of a Gabby fan. Very for, for, me, yeah, yeah. for me, Pedri just has the, the controlling of the game. He has such a completeness and roundness to, to controlling the tempo of games yeah. at such a young age. The maturity of decision making. He's, he's, he's got understanding of space at such you a young age. Uh, well, so like, crazy. Like, for me, like he's just that was what, yeah. technical ability. Now, what a great, what a great, like, an, a great analysis. Beautiful analysis of Pedri. I think that is. The second best analysis we've had on Pedri on this podcast. <laughs> I think Elias, Elias famously. Broke, I think he was, I think he was I 18 that. years old yeah. and he plays yeah, well, like. Where was the TikTok a, for that, man? Yeah. Plays like he has an eight inch cock. <laughs> 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 hey! Yeah. Elias said that after the Euros. After the Euros, he, uh, he marched onto the scene, <laughs> said, This is my midfield. Uh, <laughs> that was analysis. I was not expecting that to go there. That's OG SDS right there. <laughs> that's, that's when we was doing seven man tables, that's eight crazy. man tables. That's yeah, that is crazy. crazy. Yeah. Three man chair in the mic. It was crazy. Do you not think though, Jude, this season his game has improved in terms Apps, of bro. being able to control a yeah. game. His close control. Oh, classical the other day. So oh. much better than 
I thought last season he was a bit more of the Gerard mold. Uh, yeah. Like all action midfielder, wants to get in the hustle and bustle. But this season I'm more seeing of more guile, more technique, yeah. more kind of vision in his passing as well. It's like, I don't know. I was, I was, I was, uh, Lee Ban was, was uh, tweeting about it, I think, uh, just the other day. And I, I think out of all of the youngsters, Jude is the most complete in terms of he's the all action midfielder. Yeah. He's the one who will be getting back and making challenges yeah. outside his box. He has that more roundness to his game in terms of uh, a two way player. Mm -hmm. But I just, the magic of when I see Pedri on the ball, for me, he's not even a youngster. He doesn't look like a youngster, bro. Yeah. He just looks like someone who's seen so many different situations in football that he knows how to adapt to them all so quickly. Musiala's <laughs> another one, a maverick of the game. Wow. He's just someone I'm who just what causes what chaos. What bothers me about Musiala now is he's going, he's going to, if he carries on the way he's going, he's going to go into that realm of very good with the ball. Mm. Final third is not where it should be. I was going to say, I hate his shooting technique. There's something about him when he gets yeah. into that final third. It's either he dwells on the ball for too long, beats some extra man, we and then the pass is gone. Yeah. Or it's he, like, needs, he needs Pep. He need, yes, he needs someone to fine wow. tune him. Pep. He wow. needs that final fine tuning because wow. Pedri's got that fine tuning. Yeah. Jude's got that fine tuning. Mm. Musiala, I feel like, just needs that a little bit of WD40. He's got, he's got just that. a little Pep, bit of something Pep in there. Pep will turn him into the next De Bruyne. Like, nah. Do you know who Pep needs? <clears throat> well, Musiala. Oh, Florian, Florian Verts. Verts. Yeah. If you lot let what Pep get him in the summer, it's, yeah. Yeah, it's long. Orida. 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 As the kids say. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, going back to Jude, one worry I have for him also is when they do sign a striker in the summer, can he play in a midfield three, but the way Real Madrid play a midfield three? They have that traditional one sitting and they Too have many. two tech yeah. men in front of him. Yeah. The two tech men is going to be Kamavinga and him because yeah. obviously Modric to Cruz. I think he will become a left back. Uh, that's what I feel like is going to happen to him, unfortunately. Yeah. Verde, yeah. this season, Fede very is brilliant. Fede is brilliant. Will tell yeah. you, but Fede <laughs> yeah. and Jude will be- It's a good midfield. The good workhorses, options. but yeah, work I feel like they're yeah. technical as yes, well. They are very that's technical. the thing. Yeah, it's yeah, like yeah. so much, we were saying those glue guys, they're not really anything. They're two that actually have definitive traits that they can make a difference in the game, in my opinion. Kamavinga will end up at PSG. They'll sell him the center midfield rock dream. Yeah, they'll sell him the center midfield dream. Kamavinga, Chouamini and Bellingham are staying there for the next 10 years. They're Galacticos, bro. They're Galacticos, but the one who is a center midfielder, man. And, and you know- Hard who you're talking about. He's, he's young. Oh, he's young. There as well. Kamavinga's oh, young. Kamavinga's young. He's French. Endrick, Endrick comes in the summer. PSG's- What's they, going on, bro? I told PSG you, bro. comes to him and say to him, yo, we, we've got the center mid spot for you there. You're coming back to France. Oh, no. I, I think, you I you think don't think have to worry about much Madrid, about Champions League. When you're at Madrid, <laughs> you're, you're at the you top don't want to You're only going to leave if you're pushed out. Yes. You're never going to leave because of, oh, PSG- No team Yeah, yeah. Hey, man, I can go back to PSG when I'm 30. No, but for me, the only way you can get swayed is, yo, I'm selling you the center midfield dream. You could play centre. Is that round? Yeah, I know it's a weird if, one. If I was him, I would even take the left back because I know what I'm getting when I'm yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Everything I'm gonna win, the mm. the success, the glory. Nah, yeah. forget it. You're not gonna yeah. get that at PSG, man. Yeah. And no you're gonna get fifty percent taxed anyway. So <laughs> it's yeah, a good. Bit. It's something yeah, they think about. Listen, it's something they think about. PSG very... ain't all life and glory. As, 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 as they should. All right, the final <laughs> one. Yeah, the final one. Should, yeah, yeah. Um, what? I got one actually. You know, he agreed with you. Are you gonna? Go on, go on. Oh, I was gonna say. Ange wins a trophy before Arteta. From now. From now. Yeah. Well, put Ange your hand up, man. Wait, 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 let me think. Wait. What? what, okay, what you still in the up? No. You out? No. So, yeah, so we, are, we are in it. We are in it. Oh, you got Spurs, you got City. Yeah. Okay, obviously not in the Carabao anymore. Uh, nah, I'm not sure, man. Um, Europe, are you in Europe right oh. now? You're not in Europe, we're in Champions League. Man, you guys. My hand's down, bro. Stay cool. over there, man. Your hands, okay, Fouad's only hand has gone up. Yeah, I'm, yeah. Of course it's gone up, he's Tottenham fan. Does community yeah. count? Come on, serious trophies. Just making sure. Yeah, but how, but FA Cup, when Carabao, they go FA Bay, Carabao. Yeah, when they go to the Community Shield, you don't have to win a trophy to get there. his trophies. Actually, right. don't have to win the FA Cup in the Premier League. Well, when don't have to. Did no, you hear I've what you said? That. You see, Abs, there, there shouldn't even be a Community Shield that year. If you win the FA Cup and the Premier League, it should be Community Shield. Play second place in the room. What's playing second place? I'm turning up for participation. It's almost like Christmas Day, the NBA. He said this Community Shield count. You have to win a trophy to get to Community Shield. Oh, yeah. What did City win? Now they come second to get to the City. Yeah, I know. Well, keep on the conversation. Did, what, on, what trophy did you win? I was so <laughs> fixated on you. On that one point. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> what trophy yeah. did you win? Yeah. 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 We were literally, we were literally just in the community show. We won the community show. This, what community? What did you do? How did you win the community show? Did you win the trophy? I told you, you lot, it's 3 a.m. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's 11.30. It's 3.29 a.m. It's 3.29 a.m. It's 3.29 a.m. No one agreed with you. Sorry, buddy. So we'll move on to the last one. Last one. Eden Hazard is the greatest Belgian to play in the Premier League. Yeah. Abs's hand is up. Fouad snoring. Ellis' hand is down, and my hand, hand is down. also down. You got Kevin. So Abdullah we all Bruno. think Romelu Lukaku. Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, oh, sorry. I thought you were going Yamba Tongan. Uh, <laughs> That's totally all the viral. No, yeah. Thomas from Ireland. Uh, uh, yeah. Trust on? joke with that one. Trust on? Nasser Chadley. Oh! <laughs> hey, hey, we're forgetting the main one. Seaman Mignolet. You know what I was thinking? Oh. Jason Denier. Jesus, did I say Seaman? I said Seaman. I said Seaman. <laughs> nah, but Timber Courtois for sure though. Courtois. Yeah. Yeah. Argument yeah, no chance, sure. boys. Yeah. You, do, do you want to so answer the question? Hazard. Ask, ask yeah, Vincent Hazard. Company. Yeah. Oh, mm. there you go. Uh, Vincent uh, Company said it was Hazard. Where is he? Do you have his number? No, nah, I don't. Sorry, man. No, Shane, we're asking that's, you. I'm sure that TV we're asking you. Go on, man. Why, why is why is he in Hazard? Why Eden Hazard? One person, one person, one person between them, bro. Yeah, Amir. Amir's the one to the separation. Amir's the one to the separation. Amir's the one to the separation. Amir's the one to get. Amir had the Fabian Delphine's wedding as well. Oh, what's going on here? Delphine's as well. Yeah. He's popping in City. The basics of football, guys. The basics. in Manchester. Hey, we have to check in with him next time. Next time we go, man, you got to check in with him. Yeah, look, but for me, hands up. So why do you think yeah. Hazard's the greatest bowler? Just memory? have a look at what happened in the 2018 World Cup. You know, have a look at what you. Is that the Premier League? The I don't know. That. I'm just saying the greatest Belgian to play. Look what they did when they were both playing together in Belgium. Is the, oh, it's not something. Both playing in the Premier League, yeah. both playing in the Premier League. It was Hazard's league. The same way that we just said that the Bruyne. It's the Bruyne's league. No, yeah. Right now it is. Before it was. Before it was the Bruyne's oh, league. Whose league wait, was wait, it? It was never just Hazard's league, though. That's the thing. Oh yes, it was. Oh yes, it was. What's the age gap between them? Like one year, maybe. Maybe less. Oh yeah, so, and De Bruyne uh, older. Wait, 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 wait. So you mean to tell me Kevin De Bruyne has come back from a six month layoff yep. and he's already about to cook the greatest league in the world mm -hmm. and remind him that he's the king here. And where's Eden? Where is Eden Hazard? Oh, Hazard, yeah, Hazard, 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 him. Hazard, Hazard, obviously, shout out him. His career's over now. His career's over. But that's, that's, that's that. the point. <laughs> right, I want you to take reins. I want you to take the reins on this one. No, no, where is Eden Abdullahi Hazard? Where is Hazard these days? No, but for me, we look at what Hazard did in the Premier League. He's he's. Where are your age mates? He's doing it again. Don't you know he it. trained too it. hard and got injured. <laughs> Have you ever heard of that? Yeah. I started to train, so I had to retire early. Oh, yeah. Come on, man. Listen, listen, you, man. listen. It sounds funny. These are all nice little jokes, but when when he was in the Premier League, this guy was badding up the league, bro. This was his league while he was here, bro. De Bruyne, and obviously got De, Bru shook. De Bruyne, De Bruyne, bro. De Bruyne. I'm not saying De Bruyne is a meme. I'm not bro. saying you're saying. I'm not saying Hazard's meme. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. The reason that Hazard's above is we look at what happened when they played together. It's not. It can't be discounted when the stage for Belgium, when they were the golden generation, was who's gonna step up now? We need yeah, you man stepping up. It was supposed to be Hazard. It just didn't. Uh, you, no, in the 2018 World Cup, who turned up, bro? Where was De Bruyne? He was there. He was there, but he wasn't performing. Neither was Hazard. Neither was Hazard. What? Brother, they had Yannick Carrasco playing sorry, left sorry, back. Sorry, sorry, one second. We're not moving past that point. We're not moving at all. No, we're not moving past that point. We're not moving past that point. Because when it was when it was Belgium versus we're Brazil, was it Wales? No, when it was Belgium Wales? versus Brazil, no Brazil, they finished Brazil, third. Yes, yes. Bro, when they and they, when they beat England to go third, Euros, they beat they beat England to go third. When it was Belgium versus Brazil, it was builders Neymar Hazard. This is it, the golden generation of Belgium. Who turned up? What? Yeah, what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, the, who turned yeah, up? The Bruno was when never meant the, to be this the, great the, player. He is like bro, this level. He, 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 he was got, he got, sorry. The Bruno was never meant to be great. I'm saying no. I'm not saying great. But I'm saying like the Bruno's the player who everyone forgot about. He didn't make it at Chelsea. Everything. Yeah, Hazard was always meant to be the the, the the like. And he did that. And he did that. Yeah. But the Bruno's produced high levels in the Premier League. I think so. The Bruno has been the best player in the Premier League. Full stop. Full stop. And that's what reducing the injuries. Seven years mm. of greatness is what we got Can from you, who? From Kevin De Bruyne. Yeah. Can you count seven years of greatness from Hazard? When did he come into the league? 12. 12 2013. And left in 13 and left in 19. He didn't even play for seven years in the Premier League, bro. Interesting. Mm -hmm. and what happened, and what happened I'm going to use that against him. Uh, okay, brother. Hey, man, listen. Interesting. Same age. Same age. Mm, you know what I mean? Certain man look after themselves. Certain man had a knee injury. They come back. No, they some people are blessed with football that they don't hey, need to train hey, during the week. Some man they don't need to train the week. Some man are professional. No, I, some I agree. Are consistent. De Bruyne is a brilliant Some man come in and do the hard work. Talk some man want to do undo laces. You know, hey, man, mm. I'm a footballer. Some people, it just comes naturally. I'm a jugador. Abs would say. Jugador. Jugador playing in the park now. With my brethren, <laughs> while KDB is tearing up the Premier League, we yeah. all hear the point. Get bro, your you man, bro. bro. He, he's, he's, Belgian, his his career, you. his career. To be honest, for me, he shouldn't have gone Madrid and started to think that he has to change the way he but plays. Guess what? He if he had, he if he had gone, there. no, no, he, he thought he could. That no, was the it, dream move for him. No, for sure. He clocked the Premier League. He thought. Yeah. He thought I'm ready for the next yeah. stage. Ronaldo. I'm he thought he had to change, shirt. yeah. He You're thought he had guy, to change to play for Madrid. He shouldn't have done it. Check. Like you say, that the training hard. the training that he did week, uh, week in, week you, out for Madrid you hurt him. You take shortcuts all your life and then think when you get to the top, you're, you're going to succeed. No chance. Never mm. in life can you cheat the grind. Uh, inspiration. Mm. You can't cheat the grind. Motivation mm. for yeah? mm. Go run in the park and do some laps now. 
<laughs> while my bridge is warm up. <laughs> Hilarious, man. <laughs> there you go, man. man. Hazard is, is the best Belgian to play in the Premier League. <laughs> After Kevin De Bruyne. No, man. And, uh, I, I, you just got <laughs> dunked on. Balls no, in your face. It's, a, it's an agenda. I hear it, man. But it's it's, 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 it's it's the real men. I hear it, man. I hear it, man. <laughs> hey, nothing to do with real men. It's, it's he's just not better than KDB, bro. <laughs> no, he's better. It's the facts. And the last, the last, the than KDB, last hot sure. take. Rene D is the best footballer on SDS. Hmm? Rene D is the best footballer on SDS. When fit. My when hands fit. up. Hey, let's hands up. Hands up. My hands up. Mine's not. Fads hands down. The small, the small. I've just hands I've down. Rin. Not been impressed. I've, I've just right. been right. Let's I'm, discuss then. I'm consistent. I'm for the one percenters of personally, SDS. Yeah, this is for the one percenters. Personally, I think but I'm sitting next to the best player. Okay. Oh, oh, wow. he's around next to you. I appreciate that, man. I think I'm sitting next to the best player. I appreciate player. that. Fair. Fair. I appreciate that. Thank, thank you. Thank you. I don't sleep on it. I respect this, Billy. I've met Seymour Levin side though. I see, I see yeah. why they call him Busquets. I'm mm. not saying what I'm saying. This right man. here, see United when they're talking about number sixes. Mm. Mm. They, need, they, they need, they need me, man. Menu. Facts. Come watch abs. And he's yeah. the right age as well. Yeah. Yeah. Right it's age. the right profile. It's the right profile. too old, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 he even said the other day, he was to rise and ballers. He said, yeah, I watched the oldest. Yeah, there you go. The oldest. Yeah, there you go. The oldest. There you go. He was watching you while you was in the stands. <laughs> why is your hand down? Um, because I don't think he's the best player in this, yes. So you uh, think someone else is? Yeah. He's living off Who's reputation. That? I think I think I think Elias is. Thank you. Appreciate it, man. Yeah. But I'm, I'm consistent. You know I've had this. You've been saying that for I've a few been years saying now. this for, for, for a, a couple of years now. Still. He's been saying that. But listen, I have Rindy, he's brilliant. He's, I he's, give it to Rindy. I've watched him play um who did you used to play for last year? Uh, uh so was that what Hillen and Burrow? Yes. I watched to be fair, Hill I didn't Burrow? watch that. Mm. I, I wasn't there. I wasn't there. He's very good eleven aside. PMP. Yeah, for striker, me, if it was 11 attacker. sides court. No, no, he is PMP. Really, he will yeah. say he's PMP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, yeah. He'll tell, no, no. He'll he's tell you he's got flair. Flair. Nah, bro, I was gonna he's say. Got flair. Yeah, he's not got, he's not got flair. flair. Yeah, he's not got yeah, flair. Yeah. He's not got flair. He's a very. He's a, <laughs> For no reason, he's a he's a he's a PMP player. He's got a lot of pace and power. It's that West African in him. Don't blame him. Yeah. But um, he's he's a very good player. He's, I would say he's better Listen, than me because he's yeah, an eleven side footballer. My hand was up. My hand was up. Yeah. For me, football is different. Yeah. For like, me, it's preference. There's five side football, there's yeah. seven side football, there's eleven side football. Mm. I have a different best player from SS for each of them. Seven yeah. aside, I'll be better. And for me, eleven yeah. aside is a football. Is is, is football eleven side? Go on, tell us. Rene D is the best eleven side footballer in SDS. Ilias is the best player. Five aside, seven aside. When fully fit, Liban I think is best player five aside in SDS. Yeah, Liban, when he's fully fit, very good. He's very good. Very good. There's five to seven, there's eleven. All different types of games. And football's yes. 11 sides. Someone, Someone said, what about Faisal? Someone said, what about Faisal? <laughs> he's, I don't even think he's the best goalkeeper in this year. <laughs> <laughs> Little high on you, blood. <laughs> he definitely is. He definitely is. Uh, yeah. How can he flex? He said I got a hat trick. Do you remember the 5-7? You got yeah, a hat trick. I missed that day. Yeah, yeah so man, funny. I wasn't there that day. One of them was a pen. Crap, you. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I wasn't even there that day. I wasn't there that day. Uh, well, but yeah, just, guys, that was our hot takes. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, we'll see you guys uh, again soon for another video. Hi, Bye. man.